I actually had my first story, Evil Ernie, published by a different publisher. That was Malibu Graphics. And then it, uh, I think Ernie was going to be published again, but in a different imprint at that company. And we had negotiated a sequel when that was going to be Evil Ernie, The Resurrection. And we had agreed in principle verbally on what we were going to do on a Friday. And like the following Monday, they called up and said, yeah, we're not going to publish this stuff. Now, it's really lost to time why that happened. Um, I actually am on very good talking terms with those guys. But at the time, you know, it was intense. It was like, holy mackerel, now we have nowhere to go. And, you know, I had done enough feeling out of other publishers that I kind of knew it was like, no one really gets the stuff that I do. So I'm going to have to just do it myself. That's really what it came down to. And I really had no discernible skill for this. I knew nothing about comic publishing. But I realized that if I wanted to tell my stories on my own terms, I had to form a comic book publishing company. And thanks to the 